Welcome to Grade 4 Mathematics, Quarter 4, Week 3. Visualizes the volume of a solid using standard and non-standard units and finds the volume of a rectangular prism using cubic centimeter and cubic meter. This lesson is designed to help you master the following skills. Visualizes the volume of solid figures in different situations using non-standard, e.g. marbles, etc. and standard units and finds the volume of a rectangular prism using cubic centimeter and cubic meter. Lesson 1 Visualizes the volume of a solid using non-standard units. Let's have an example. Alan and Andrea wanted to find the volume of an empty box. First, they filled it with balls. About 15 balls filled in the box. Next, they filled the box with marbles. About 115 marbles filled the box. Then they filled the box with beans. About 130 beans filled the box. Did Alan and Andrea get the same number of units for the volume of a box? Why? Alan and Andrea did not get the same number of units for the volume of a box because they used non-standard units. Balls, marbles, and beans are the example of non-standard units. Can you think of other objects that can be used as non-standard units? Here are the words to remember. Volume is the amount of space a solid figure occupies. Solid figures are three-dimensional objects. Capacity is almost the same as volume. It is the maximum amount that something can contain. The container that can be filled up the spaces to occupy of a figure is capacity. The object that filled up the spaces of the container is called non-standard unit. Non-standard units can be used to measure the volume or capacity of a solid figure. Non-standard units do not give consistent and accurate measurement of a volume. When the non-standard unit is small, more units are needed to fill the solid figure. When the non-standard unit is bigger, fewer units are needed to fill the solid figure. Another example, there were two different kinds of boxes filled with ping pong balls of the same size. The first box has 500 ping pong balls and the second box has 720 ping pong balls. Does the second box has the greater volume than the first box? In this case, we can now compare the capacity or volume of two boxes since we use the same object as a unit of measurement. We can say that the second box has the greater volume than the first box. Lesson 2 Visualizes the volume of a solid using standard units. Can you tell the volume of the solid figure below? Study the figure. The figure uses cubes to measure its volume. Cube has equal sides. If all sides of a cube is 1 cm, this cube measures 1 cubic centimeter. Since the figure contains 45 cubes, we can say that the volume 
of a figure is 45 cubic centimeters. Here are, again, words to remember. Standard units gives consistent and accurate measurement. Standard units can be metric system, centimeter, meter, or kilometer, and or English system, inch, yard, mile. We usually use metric system of measurement. Cubic units is the standard unit to measure the volume of a figure. It can be cubic centimeter, cubic meter, or cubic kilometer. Lesson 3. Finding the volume of a rectangular prism. A rectangular prism has 6 faces, 12 edges, and 8 vertices. This solid figure here is a rectangular prism. Faces are the flat surfaces of the prism. So here are the faces. Vertex or vertices in plural is the corner of the prism. Here are the vertices. Edge is a line segment between faces of the prism. So here is one edge, another edge, another edge, another edge, and another edge. And here is another edge. Three-dimensional figure consists of length, width, and height. Here is a rectangular prism. Width height equals 3 cm, width equals 2 cm, and length equals 6 cm. Let's take one of its face, or the upper part. So here is the upper part. It is in rectangular shape with the length of 6 cm and the width of 2 cm. Solve its area first. Formula for the area is equal to length times width. Area is equal to length, which is 6 cm, times the width, which is 2 cm. Area is equal to 12 square centimeters. The area of one face is 12 square centimeters. Take a look at the height. It seems that it has three layers of rectangular shape that we have just solved. Let us now multiply the area of the rectangle and the height. Area times the height is equal to area is 12 square centimeters times the height which is 3 centimeters. It is equal to 36 cubic centimeters. This is the volume of the given rectangular prism. We can now come up with the formula to solve volume. The formula is V is equal to L times W times H in which V is the volume, L is the length, W is the width, and H is the height. Cubic centimeter is read as cubic centimeter. Let's have an example. The container is in the shape of a rectangular prism. Its length is 10 cm, width is 6 cm, and height is 4 cm. What is the volume of the container? First step, draw the figure. So here is the rectangular prism. Then identify its dimensions. What are the dimensions? Length is equal to 10 centimeters. So here is the length. Width is equal to 6 centimeters. Here is the width. And height is equal to 4 centimeters. 
and here is the height next solve volume using the formula V is equal to L times W times H so the volume is equal to L which is 10 times V which is 6 times H which is 4 the volume is equal to 10 times 6 times 4 which is equal to 240 cubic centimeters or volume is equal to 240 cubic centimeters remember volume is the amount of space a solid figure occupies solid figures are three-dimensional objects capacity is almost the same as volume it is the maximum amount that something can contain the container that can be filled up the spaces to occupy of a figure is capacity. The object that filled up the spaces of the container is called non-standard unit. Non-standard units can be used to measure the volume or capacity of a solid figure. Non-standard units do not give consistent and accurate measurement of a volume. When the non-standard unit is small, more units are needed to fill the solid figure. When the non-standard unit is bigger, fewer units are needed to fill the solid figure. Standard units give consistent and accurate measurement. Standard units can be metric system, centimeter, meter, or kilometer, and or English system, inch, yard, mile. We usually use metric system of measurement. Cubic units is the standard unit to measure the volume of a figure. It can be cubic centimeter, cubic meter, or cubic kilometer. Rectangular prism is a solid figure. Rectangular prism is a three-dimensional object that has six faces, 12 edges, and eight vertices, the same as cube. Faces are the flat surfaces of the prism. Vertex, or vertices in plural, is the corner of the prism. Edge is a segment where two faces of the prism meet. Three-dimensional figure consists of length, width, and height. Formula of volume of rectangular prism. V is equal to L times W times H. Cubic centimeter is read as cubic centimeter. Cubic meter is read as cubic meter.